Hello everybody, the Republic Gamer here, and in today's video we're going to be playing another Let's Play The Hospital. Uh, I saw this game on itch.io and it kind of looks, you know, eh, decently well made. Uh, I don't really know man, anything much about this game, I just came across to it. Uh, all I know is you're taking place in a hospital, it's a horror game, and not really much other to say. Also, I saw some videos, also version 1.8, what? Okay, well let's get into it. All right, all right. So I chucked down the uh, audio because I want to make sure it's not too loud. I mean, probably for jump stairs, but all right. Adjust the brightness. Oh, uh, actually, I want it all the way because I want to be able to see stuff and the items too. I don't want it too dark, not just because I'm scared, but whatever. Okay. That is very, very, very right. I don't know what word it is I was going to look for. But when the virus got me, I was hoping I would be among the majority who got only mild symptoms and recover quickly. But my conditions grew worse day by day. Ugh. Didn't like how the COVID happened either, which is very, very painful when that happened. I checked into this hospital last week, barely able to breathe. I paid a lot to get a private room, and I was lucky that they managed to find one. Very lucky. Six. Sick. So many dying. Oh my gosh. It's kind of like the flashback of how the coronavirus happened. I, I'm pretty sure some of you guys did remember that, but I, I think a lot of people already forgotten about that, and it, it's been gone. Or is it still around? I just don't remember. Actually, it's already gone, so I'm just gonna think of it. I feel like I've become a number <laughs> Okay, yeah, sure, all right. Oh my gosh. I think I'm growing sicker. I feel faint and weak all the time. Yeah, that's how it is every, you know, sickness and viruses. Yesterday at night, they had to increase my oxygen intake. I heard them taking, or actually no, talking about having to put me under the t intubate. Intubate me if my condition got worse. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like what this is going, going. Uh, I f I'm feeling weak, so weak. I think I'll sleep now. Can barely breathe. Okay, yeah. Uh, actually, actually, don't sleep because what if you don't wake up? Don't the body just shuts down? And then you're gone forever. Unless the hospitals got their ways. Which, of course, they do. Okay, I'm up. How am I up on my feet? I can't remember getting out of the bed. And walk around using... Ooh, I need to observe my surroundings. This game saves automatically. You do not have to see... Oh, so I might have to do multiple parts in this if if you guys do want multiple parts in this hospital room. My bed, it looks as if it was recently made. When did I get off with what okay? If I was like sleeping on it, wouldn't it just be like messy? Like oh I'm sorry, I'm clicking through it. Wouldn't it just be messy and someone has to like, you know, make a bed and they just make it flat? I don't know. I spent days on this bed struggling to breathe. It's weird. To be up that yeah it should be like all crumbly and mess but it seems perfectly clean which is weird chairs chairs for visitors except being in quarantine i had no visitors medical device it's silent i remember the doctor and nurses hooking me up to this thing it's infernal beeping the hiss of pumping oxygen it's one of those terrifying things in a hospital all the machines wh whose purpose you don't know. Right. Uh, some medical and hospital machines do kind of look scary. But the bathroom door appears to be locked. That is uh, great to know. So do I just head out? That Ooh! Oh my gosh. Okay. That person out there. Uh, maybe a doctor. I need to find a way what's going on. Oh, shh. Where is everybody? When I checked in here, these corridors were full of activities all day and night, filled with nurses and patients. Maybe you're dreaming. Maybe you're dead and you're just dreaming. Like, 
You know, you kind of like, you know, your soul is one to actually, actually, oh my gosh, this hospital really does feel bad. Okay, um, I don't like the ambience for sure, why not, I have no choice. Uh, observe precautions, stay safe. I'm just casually checking around my surroundings. So we need to wash our hands with soap. We need to get rid of the germs. We need to keep washing our hands with soap and water and six feet apart. Yes. Like that. Lock. That's odd. There are no room numbers on the door. I'm pretty sure I seen room numbers when I checked in. Yes, yeah, someone must have took off the room number door. But then again, uh, wouldn't it just, you know, be on the door or on the side? That's convenient. And there's no shift button. Sealed, just like the others. Yeah, that's perfect. I, I, I am, uh, yep. Just like every door, such as iron, if I could say. There's the station. When I checked in here, struggling to breathe, there were two haired the kindly nurses sitting behind the desk. They sure had their hands full. Uh, do I go to this door? No luck. Didn't these doors open out to the lobby with elevators? That would have been my way out. Except it looks like I can't leave this way. I should probably find another way. Okay, hello. What are you doing here? Excuse me. Um, you shouldn't be walking around like this. I don't like... I'm gonna go this way. Screw that. Why not? Can I go this way instead? Lock. Strange. There are no signs. I could have sworn there were signs. Damn you. Screw you, lady. I know it's you. Yo. Yes. Okay. I don't like where I'm going, but sure, I have no choice. Hello? Why is it dark? In Add another light. I'm at full brightness, of course. Oh, great. I'm really, really ready for these jump scares. Of course, I am very terrified. Hello? Are these patients wards? Why are they deserted? There's got to be someone, a nurse, or a doctor, who can help me and tell me what's going on. Okay, well, definitely, because this doesn't seem right, especially as a hospital. I want to get out of here. As much I, I like to keep my health, you know, good and all steady, I don't like what this is going through. Awesome. What? Someone's in the other side of the door. Can I go in? Screw you! Okay, I, I'm just very scared. Uh, that hospital bed, how awful. There was some kind of stain or something. I guess the bed was a clean after, oh! Okay, how's it going, buddy? That figure. Should I, should I be worried about them? Should I go out there? Should I, should I be worried what's going on? All right. Screw up! I saw the figure on the TV. It reminded me of... No, it can't be. I must imagine being things. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe that's one of those whole things. It's some lucid dream I'm having while my body lies in some kind of coma. Okay, yeah, so it's lucid dream. So you're seeing a dream, but at the same time, nothing that you see is actually happening. It's actually not real. I know about lucid dreaming. Not really. I know a little bit? Some kind of coma? I don't really know much. I never had a lucid dream in my life. Did you guys have? Comment down below. Because I would actually like to, uh... No, it would be interesting to know. Uh, it would be interesting to know. It would be interesting to, uh... Uh, just... To, to see if you guys ever had a lucid dream in my life. I actually don't want to feel... I actually don't want to know what it's like to have a lucid dream. I don't know what it feels like. And I don't want to know. Because I just feel like I'll be trapped there. This is more like a lucid nightmare than a lucid dream. Thank you. 
have? Seems like I'm gonna have a jump scare. Okay, I was expecting to walk up to the body and then get jump scared, but yes, I preferred that. Of course. Is someone toying with me? Am I being led? That figure I saw. Uh, you know, as much. Hey, you. You don't. It can't be here. It is a dream, a nightmare, rather, which I'm trapped in. Controller that controls. <gasps> Stop. I don't like you, okay? Alright, I know you're controlling all of this in my dream. And I don't like what is going on. How did I get here? The furniture and a wing. This looks like the apartment where we used to live. There's something on the tape. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Uh, okay. Hello. How's it going? It can't be. It can't be her. I can't see her face, but I don't know where. <laughs> uh, she's been dead for four years. Uh, Nia, is that you? How about no? That familiar silence. This is some mysterious- Yeah, my st mysterious dream I'm having right now. Memories of those horrific events of four years ago are coming back to me. Yes. The doubt of- the I'm just, uh, the doubt and the guilt that I- Yeah, whatever. Could I have saved her life? Had I done things differently? And what- I There's- Whatever you- Whatever happened- Whatever happened in the past- it's, it's like, you, you try. You're old. Oh. Really, really, really. You're really, you're really gonna do that to me. Am I going crazy? Am I going crazy? Am I? Going, is there something behind me? Yeah, no, there's nothing behind. Me. Just like, no, it's not. Okay, maybe it's not. Okay, all right. Seriously, what's going on? Give me this, Nia. I remember this picture. We had taken out in the beach, just so not alive. Okay, well... All coming back to me. Huh? Huh? I don't want to remember this. I want to forget all of this. And besides, whatever memories I have happen... Oh, gosh. The mem... Jeez. This hospital is completely wrecked. Why are you taking me? Why do I remember that? Why do I... Okay, I don't want to remember this. How long has this video been going? I actually wanna wanna know. So I might have to cut some parts of it. Really? I don't like what Hey you! I know you're alive, you're just gonna scare me. Who would abandon a dead body here? The stench of I don't trust that. I really don't. I'm sorry. Doesn't wanna budge. Oh my god. As soon as I went to that dead body, it really wants me. It really wants me. How's it going? What do you want? She's doing this. I don't know. How is she? I have to. Yes, of course. She, she is really toying you right now. Jesus. Excuse me? Y'all alive? Or your souls are yeah out. Your soul is out of your body. <gasps> Shut up! Shut up! I'm gonna get out of here. And that's. Mm. Oh. oh. Stop. I don't like you. Not one bit. You're trash at doing this. You're bad at this. This ain't. This isn't really scary. On that night, four years ago, when I woke up to find her standing over me, she was holding a knife. As I watched her, she raised it, and I held it to her own throat. She said, I don't want to live without you. Before she could hurt herself, I leaped at her, grappled the blade away. I said, the authorities arrived. Okay, 
that is great. You did a good job. That they put her away in a institute. Oh gosh, mental hospital. And a week later, I got a terrible call. Terrible call that she might have murdered herself. That's a probability. Oh boy, oh. Why is it? Why? 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 Why are you torture? All right. After all the things I do for you, buy you stuff, money, cars, houses, food, everything. Mia, what do you want from me? I think of that note you left, the last words you ever wrote to me. You okay, mate. Okay, you're making it worse. You wrote, I'm never going to let you go. Oh my god, don't tell me. I'm not going to let you go. I don't want to hear that Rick roll. Don't. I know these words were meant for me. Is this what about? That i done things differently. It's perhaps been more compassion- Oh, compassionate. You might still have- You might still be alive. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Is that it? Am I alive? I'm back in my room. How did I get here? Mia? Let's go. Do I dare go out there? What will I find? Bus, bus, a bustling hospital? Smiling face telling me I'm better and I could go home? Or shadow? Shadowy halls haunting? Am I in a coma? Trapped in a body that is... Wasting away while I suffer a fever dream born of guilt. Or am I dead? And this and is this my afterlife? These dread halls and a tormenting soul stalking me for all eternity. Maybe. The end. That was um quite interesting game. Well, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys are. Oh, wait, it didn't crash? Oh, maybe it didn't. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. That was uh, actually quite an interesting game. 20 minutes. All right, I better end this video right now because I don't want the video to get any longer. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like the video if you kind of like, like me getting scared. I don't know. But I don't care because whatever that happened in the game happened. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. So that way you can see me play, you know, or, you know, be a part of this cool channel. Or you can just think this, this channel is interested. Interested. Whatever. Or you just like this channel because it's cool. Amazing. Let's play. Yeah. And turn on the notifications so that way you'll be notified when Let's Plays goes up like this. Horror Let's Plays, regular Let's Plays, even the FNAF will play. And get notified when I um, upload a video. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Plenty -bye. man was so... <laughs> Oh my god, 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 god.